Kanye West is removing Kim Kardashian from all of his business deals. She was definitely a part of Yeezy, okay? And he is saying, you know what? I've had enough of you, Kim. No more of you pertaining to my Yeezy campaign. And I really support it 100% because this is the same woman who basically betrayed Kanye West when he was allegedly canceled, when the world turned their back on him. Who was there for him at that time? Bianca Sensori. And that is why she is basically a uh, Yeezy now. We can all say that Bianca is Yeezy now because she's definitely married to Kanye West. I'm going to say allegedly, okay? Because if Kim betrayed Kanye West, you know, when the whole Adidas anti-Semitic thing came out, she stopped wearing Yeezy. If y'all didn't know, Kim stopped wearing Yeezy when, you know, the whole world and the Jewish community canceled Kanye West. So he is saying to himself, why would I allow Kim to be associated to Yeezy now? It's time for me to cut the, the ends off. It's time for me to cancel Kim from Yeezy. Because she made a public, you know, appearance while he was putting together a Yeezy fashion show. And she was there and, you know, she was super disrespectful. She showed up because she didn't want Bianca to be there because she knew that she could make Bianca Sensori uncomfortable. And guys... I know that we all have many things to describe Kim, but I'm going to say that she is super selfish and annoying to basically try to make someone uncomfortable. You knew that, you know, Kanye wanted Bianca there, but you showed up and you also brought your child. OK, so that way you could actually paint the narrative as you being a supportive co-parent mom. OK, and I think she is trying to be smart, but at the same time being super disrespectful. And I'm so happy that Kanye West is finding it, you know, finding the strength to make certain moves that would make his wife more comfortable, which is Bianca Sensori, because I do like this lady. She seems very down to earth, very real, very superior and strong. But I think she doesn't have time for the messy drama. I think she's very peaceful, hence why she doesn't have an Instagram account or a social media platform for herself individually. And that is why, you know, I really like her because she seems super unbothered, but she can't take the Kardashian mess because we all saw what the Kardashian sister did to Kylie's ex-best friend, Jordan Woods. They all bullied her, even though she wasn't in the 100% wrong. So Bianca Sensori fears that, you know what, Kim is going to call her entourage to bully her. Okay. And we all know that. Bianca Sensori doesn't want that. And it's also alleged that Kim threatened to basically expose Bianca Sensori because she had some nude explicit photos of her. And I spoke about that in the previous video. And we all know that was super whack, super low for Kim Kardashian because she doesn't want to be the only female that had a bad past. OK, but let me tell you something. Bianca Sensori is nothing, nothing. Nothing, not even close, honey, to become or to be like Kim Kardashian. We all know that Kim Kardashian is who she is, but Bianca Sensori is nothing like Kim. And I said what I said, okay? And Kanye West is also worried about, you know, North being in a public events, like grown-up events. And it's very uncomfortable for a father to see his daughter being dressed up in these, you know, this clothing and having this adult look being at a adult event and I told you guys before that he is super upset but whenever he comes on social media you know Kim fans have something negative to say about him and I think that that's the reason why he hasn't been on social media because everyone judged judges what he does and nothing nothing comes out of it which is good you know Unless his fans defends him, you know, other fans from Kim or the Kardashian bashes Kanye West. And I think he got so tired of it that he tries to remove himself from social media because he's not up for the bashing. Okay. 
Also, I think he's trying to protect his wife, Bianca Sensori's mental health, because we all know that, you know, if many persons have something bad to say about Kanye West, they are going to have something bad to say about Bianca. So I think he's trying to step away from the media just a bit, just to focus on what really matters, his family and also his business, okay? So I think Instagram and paparazzi are no longer one of his biggest issues. I think he's super focused and I understand that, you know, as a black man, he has been under so many pressure from society. But guess what? He's a king. I love Kanye West and Kim. I think her karma is going to be there soon. And I'm not wishing bad on Kim. I'm just saying whatever you give is what you get. So if you're going to provoke a man and his wife, you will never have peace in any relationship you try to get next time. And I've been seeing how very attention seeking she is trying to find a new lover because she is so, so lonely, guys. I Listen, if y'all see how Kim has been behaving in the public recently, y'all know she is thirsty trying to find a new boo but i told you guys if she, if a guy tries to date her it's not for love honey it's for the money and for the surgery looks okay because she doesn't have a natural look and everyone is picking up for her saying that you know what her face is real her face is no longer the natural face that she had a couple years ago okay she has done cosmetic surgery allegedly Okay, this is what I know. None of those Kardashian or Jenners looks like real people. Okay, and I said what I said. Please don't come for me, y'all. Do y'all research and y'all look it up, okay? And I told y'all again that Kanye West is so tired of the whole publicity drama. And he wants something real. He doesn't want someone who depends on the media for money or in exchange for their soul they do this for the industry he's very real he's very synced with nature and him being a person as a human being and that is why i think he moved on with bianca sensori because she is the same thing okay and he is so super talented so he's basically saying huh what am i doing with kim right now does it even make any sense i be with her it's pointless at this point Okay, and guys, we all know that Chris Jenner has everything to do with the breakup, the mat, the the whole divorce, everything, because that's her prerogative to make huge steps in her children's life, to make more money, to make more, uh, you know, public statements to look so superior and strong as a family, and that's why you know Chris Jenner has Corey. None of her marriages uh, worked out, okay, Chris Jenner. That is why, and everyone is saying that oh, she seems happy. Chris Jenner is not happy, okay. She's just trying to live within the moment, okay, because she has money. And even though they say money doesn't solve all the problems, it solves some, okay. But let me know what y'all think. Leave those comments down below, and see y'all next time. Bye, guys.